I'm building a building that looks like a boat. That's what's happening. We're, we're building, this is the pier. We may not go all the way out here. And then we're gonna, we're gonna go down and build, start building our boat out this way. So it's going to be a board fortress. For those of you that missed it, this is going to be a sort of a fortress slash adventure mode game. Um, we're gonna start as a fortress for this stream, and then the next stream, we're gonna switch over to adventure mode, grab a dwarf from this fortress, and then we're gonna go adventure out. <clears throat> and probably go to that, that necromancy tower that is, uh, like, we could probably see it from right here. It's like right up here. <laughs> So, uh, if we make it through this fortress, we may die very quickly because there is that necromancy tower. And we have this dude. Can I turn him into a pet? What's he? Oh, he's over eating everything. I guess that's what he's doing. I like the look of the, the sea. The way that the waves come, like, crashing in. I think it's very cool. We may go. So, the waves start about here. Maybe we'll just do, like, out to there. We gotta get something going here. go like to there with our pier and then we'll step down um, let's build a downstair yeah right there uh, oh we gotta build this, the floor first always running out of plump helmets um, you may be eating the seeds Something. speaking of I should do that um, starting out you don't want Plump helmet spawn. You don't want these to get cooked. Otherwise, they will eat them. And so, when you eat them, you don't get the seeds back. Whenever you turn them into drink, when you brew them, you get seeds back. Other than that, you don't. We have. We don't have any plants. This is taking a little while. We may need to get some sort of plump helmets going. You know what? Let's do it just so I don't die immediately because that would be sad. So let's let's dig it downstairs. There is an aquifer here, so we'll see how deep this aquifer is. Not that deep. Um, is that soil? Red sand wall, excellent. I guess we need an up ramp to upstairs. Then we will dig out like that. If you have a dwarf that can swim, can they build blocks underwater? I don't think so. I could be wrong though. Okay, no. I don't know that I've ever done, I mean, I've had rivers and things at my forts and, and lakes. I've never done one like by the ocean, so I've never done a lot with, um, with like the sea um, forts. Okay, we'll get a we'll get a bit of a farm going, so we can have a few plump helmets and a little bit of beer. We don't want our people freaking out immediately. This is a it's a pretty hot biome, so this I don't think this will ever freeze. Yeah, I've heard that. It's pretty rough on frame rate. Which is not something that I need. My computer chokes enough with a game. Once we get up to about a decent number of dwarves. Okay, plump helmet up. There we go. Excellent. And um, they're not growing yet, so we can't do anything with this yet. But that'll give us a little bit of, uh, of drink. Just to make sure we don't die. I mean, we could still get attacked, but that's likely I think but that way we'll get a little bit of booze going uh, a little bit of food while we can construct our boats we're almost there once we get this done we're gonna do a, a stare down oh he was sleeping on the pier we'll do a stare down and then build our lower level of the boat and then work our way up it doesn't have to be too giant but I think reasonable size would be okay all my dwarves are all my poor dwarves are just sleeping outside sorry guys We do have lots of wood out here. That's good. Is he thirsty? He doesn't seem to be doing anything. He just sort of hangs around. It's just him out here. 
Hey, gambling gamer. All right, one more, and we can build our downstairs. Yeah, build. We went downstairs. Okay, and then we'll put an upstairs on top of that, and then we can start working on our boat. So our boat will be on the... Oh, wait, do we have to go one more down? I think we do. Um, let me see here. Open space, open space. Yeah, we do have to go one more down. Turn the pier into a drawbridge. Oh, that'd be a good idea. So we went up downstairs. So then this is... Do I need another one right here? Is that right? This one just needs to be an... Oh, we'll do it. We can do both. No. So that is the water right there? Man, I don't know why I can't figure this out. So we are essentially on the water here. So this is, like, in the water? It still says open space. But yeah, this is... So that's up one. There's that level. There's... I think I'm gonna do this wrong. Am I missing something? So I am on the water right now. Why does it say that it's like open space on this level though? That doesn't make any sense. Okay. Open space. This goes down. This is, I guess, not on the water. It's in the water? I guess. Let's go something like that for the bottom of our boat. Was that someone's fighting? Somebody fight the pangolin? Pangolin is fighting what? Rolls into a ball, stands up. Oh, what's he doing? He must have gotten scared. All right, we're getting there. We're getting the bottom of the boat anyways. We're getting somewhere. So what we'll do is we'll put this... This is going to be sort of like our cargo hold. And then we'll put in a wall around it. And then go up another level. And uh, we get the idea. We'll make it look a little more boat-like. With... Let's see if I can remember that. Like that. We'll go above this. So this is going to be just the cargo hold. So it's going to be kind of a small looking area. We'll, we'll get bigger as we go up. And it'll, make, it'll look like a boat. I promise. Yeah, we know what? We didn't bring any birds, did we? <laughs> I didn't think about that. I always bring birds, but we actually don't have any. We have uh, buffalo cow, yak cow. We can, make, we can get milk. Uh, should we go ahead and do our kitchen out here? I suppose... We're going to have sort of like a farm outside. Mm. I guess we can go ahead and get a kitchen going. What is kitchen R? No, what is kitchen? Z. We'll set this one over here. Just like get it started. We can get some milk or something going on. Do I have anything for you to do yet? Yeah. Anything for you? All right, get to work. Did we ever take this apart? Yeah, all of our stuff from the uh, wagon is now over here. You got crutches. What have we got over here? We got some wood buckets, plants. There's a cat, a legendary climber cat. We have our one anvil. I didn't actually. I didn't since I didn't do the uh, planning ahead. I don't know what I have. Big tail rope, quiver. Start with lots of crutches, looks like. 
like maybe the first thing we need to do over here is maybe put our carpentry shop down here in the, in the hold. I would like to eventually get everything off of the land and into the boat. That's kind of the idea. It's to not have land things. It might actually help out if we start up a little wood stockpile over here. See if we can get them to carry stuff over there. That way they'll, so they'll haul the wood to the stockpile, then build a boat from, from there. It might save some of our walking time. Because those that are building the boat are like running all the way over here to grab the wood. There we go. Yeah, there we go. Now people are hauling, and yeah, excellent. Those waves are getting a little bit... There isn't a high tide or a low tide in the game, is there? Seems like some of these are getting a little bit closer than I remember. I guess it's just mist. Am I going to be able to farm on the boat? Let's see. And if we have to, we can always just use traders for all of our food. Or oh, we can also fish. Um, that's for food, anyways. For beer, we'll have to... I mean, we can always trade with it. But However, if our sieve is dead, um, or dying, essentially they're like not much of a sieve, I don't know what's going to happen. We might end up getting a, uh, a king, like, immediately. That would be interesting. I think it's really cool, though. I'm I'm really glad that that happened. So now, however many forts that we end up doing with this version, that means we're going to be building the Dwarven civilization. You know, I almost chose going with a human sieve rather than dwarves this time. Um, so that would have been funny if there was actually no dwarves in the game. No tide. So we've got that side. We can probably go ahead and work on a little bit of a wall. And the wall we're going to do something like, I guess something like this. We're going to have to do a little bit of finagling with the, the floor. Let's go ahead and get these sides done. <laughs> Dead dwarf civilization and survivors going to sea as pirates. <laughs> yeah, so I mean, I, I, the idea here, the idea behind all of this is this is a band of, of dwarves that we've decided to resort to piracy. We're running off to the sea. We're building a boat. And then after this stream, the next the next stream, um, we're going to switch over to adventure mode to grab a dwarf from this fort, as long as, assuming this fort survives today. And then we're going to run out and uh, loot and pillage and steal artifacts and bring them back. As long as the game didn't just crash on me. Did you just crash? Save? Auto save? Uh, don't crash on me, game. Don't crash on me. Okay, summer has arrived. Okay. <laughs> Where's my, like, my... That was an auto save. It just... <laughs> Where's my thing? Where's sound sense? Sound sense, why aren't you telling me these things? Why aren't you telling me? Yeah, it says it said it was now summer. I didn't hear it. it. Must not be downloaded correctly. It's not over yet. It's still here. And that was an autosave, so now we're good. <laughs> oh, I hate Dwarf Fortress. I have not played version 43 yet, so I don't know how stable it is. It seems like version 42 actually wasn't too bad. I had a lot of prob problems um, with version 34. I had a lot of issues with that one crashing on me. The last one wasn't too bad, though. So what we need to do here is, is we're going to actually have to put a floor here to get our... Um, well, you'll see in a second. I just hit a wall. Whoops. Move that one. I know I removed these early, but I actually need these in here. And then we're going to have... This is the way we have to sort of work on uh, getting our walls cool looking. 
One crash in about 12 hours and 43. That's that's really good. That's actually that's that's good for Dwarf Fortress. I mean, I've gone times um, with older versions where like I couldn't even really go an hour. Uh, my my first let's play I did with Dwarf Fortress was version was that 34? The one before 42. And I could only like record one I got to a point where I would only record one episode, which is 30 minutes long, before I would save it. Because if I ever tried doing a second uh, episode at the same time, it would crash on me. So I always basically just was like, alright, whatever, I guess we're going to do one episode per recording. So we're going to put a wall here. Wall there. Uh, come on. And then over here. So we can't build diagonally, which is sort of the problem. But I want this boat to look kind of cool. So, and this is just sort of the cargo hold. But we have a floor now, so we can go ahead and put in our, um, our craft horse shop, which we will do, which is going to go right here. Custard apple wood. Don't tell me these things about things crashing. I don't want to hear it. Let me fix this a little bit. I want you to scoot over just a little bit. There we go. All right, so we've got our bit of a wall going. Uh, so the bottom will be like the cargo hold. So we've got a craft. We got the um, the carpenter's shop, which will make some doors and whatever, um, and beds. And we're gonna put a lot of our stockpile stuff down here. And then we're going to go up a level. We'll probably have, like, our living quarters up there. Um, <laughs> and uh, and then above that, we can do... I don't know. We'll figure out something up there. So let's... Oh, yeah. Go ahead and, and do things. Let's make, um, make a few beds. Four beds is fine. Make a couple doors. Um, a couple of bar barrels, just in case we need them. And bins are... What is it? Bin in? Bin. Bin, bin. Bin, bin. A couple bins. Just get something started there. Are you suspended? No. There we go. Our final floor piece is now in. Excellent. Um, let's remove this floor tile. You can't build on things on floor tiles. This is why I'm doing so. I'm going to make this boat look a little more rounded. We want you to go up to here as a wall. Remove you. Come on, remove them already. Wall. We'll go there. Be a little tedious at first, sort of micromanagey and, and and all that, but I think it'll be cool once it once it gets done. I think it'll be worth it. How's our plump helmets going? Uh, do we not have any seats? No plump helmet seats. Why? Oh, I know why. I know why. You drink from plants. Do it forever. So once we squeeze the plump helmets, we we squeeze the juice out or whatever we do with them, and then we. Go replant the seeds. Do we have any of these? No. We'll move that floor right there. And then we can complete... So you see how it's sort of rounded? It's kind of neat. And then we're going to go up another level and then do uh, basically the same thing again. We'll put a floor on top of this. We need to put like a some sort of stairwell in the middle, I think. Um, in fact, do we want to do that in the here? No, we'll do it. We'll do it starting up here. I want to get this bottom part done. Then we'll start working on the top part and all the um, flooring. Is things going correctly over here? Yes, we are now brewing drinks, which means we're getting seeds, and there we go, now we're planting. Excellent. 
We have seven meat in storage, which I'm assuming are fish. Um, we're still doing alright. We got 30 seeds, 60 drink. Yeah, we're doing alright. I haven't assigned anyone any sort of uh, jobs yet. Reg is our expedition leader. Militia commander, we don't need that just yet. Uh, we do need a broker, which is going to be... I don't know. Tutus. There you go, you're, you're a uh, broker. Bookkeeper is going to be Borath. No one has any skills for it, so... Doesn't really matter. That way we can get some sort of... Well, we can't get numbers yet because we don't have an office. Why is this one not getting done? Needs empty food storage item. Oh, we need barrels. Something has collapsed on the surface. Well, that's not good. Oh, because I... Okay. It didn't kill anybody, did it? Okay. <laughs> uh, because I removed this, it removed that wall that was there. Um, interesting. I put a wall there. Interesting that that collapsed. The other ones didn't collapse like that. Hmm. Maybe a wave hit it? Oh, hey, migrants are here already. Excellent. Let's save real quick. I don't know why the saves are so much longer. Um, saves were pretty quick last time. We have a little more history. We went... What year is it? 187. That may be a little bit... Have something to do with the saves taking so long. It's the same size world, but I've got a lot more civilizations, a lot more sites, a lot more... Um, civilizations and sites are moved up. Beasts and savagery are moved up. Let's see how many we got. Wait. Did we lose somebody? We did lose somebody. What? Did he fall? Oh, he did fall in, didn't he? <laughs> yeah, because we... Oh, man. Is he... Do we see his body? There he is. Oh, no. Solon. Oh, and he has the copper battle axe. Oh, that's terrible. I hope I have... I think... I probably just have the one copper battle axe, too. That really sucks. Man. Well, I'm glad we got some new arrivals. Maybe they brought a battle axe with them. We got two new ones so far. What are you trying to do? Equipment mismatch. Alright. I gotta get rid of that sound. We'll take a break here in like 30 minutes or so and I'll, I'll get rid of that. Well, the um, the boat isn't below the water. The boat is like sitting on top of the water. That's what I when I when I first tried this thing out uh, on my own, I I put it into a um, like a cold place, so the the sea was frozen for a few months. Um, that didn't work real well though because everyone died as soon as it thawed. So let's remove that. How are we going to do this now? Mm, I hate bird lives. Solon's been missing for a week. I know where he is. He's at the bottom of the ocean. <laughs> Poor guy. Poor Solon. My woodcutter. With the battle axe. He died with the battle axe, which is even worse. All right, let's try putting a floor here. Put a floor there, and then a wall there. Remove that, and then put the wall in, and then we'll be good. Now, for upstairs. Um, as soon as, well, let him do this first. Because I want to make sure this is done correctly. Put a wall right there. Cashew. This is a cashew boat. Now we want to D in. Remove that floor. Now don't die. Takes so long to remove floors. Do it faster. Wall. There. 
Railings? No, this is this is not. There's no railings in this ship. <laughs> okay, so the bottom is done. Now let's let's uh, move up. So we're gonna put a floor right there. Guava wood and kumquat wood and date palm wood. Um, just like that. Let's go ahead and do all of it. And right there. Whoops, what did I just hit? Did I hit wall? I know what you mean. On the side of the... On the side... Okay, you may... Yeah, I think you're probably right about this. I probably have to put a railing on this side. That's probably a good idea. Um, I want... We need some sort of center mass. I didn't center it real well at all, so the mass is going to be off. Oh, this is terrible. Um, we can make a big one. And we want an up downstair to go. We gotta get the wall first. I suppose it can just be an upstair at this point, and then we'll make it um, up down above that. Equipment mismatch. Is somebody a hunter? Um, oh, you know what? Speaking of of uh, new people, how many did we, did we get? We only got we got what four. Albatross. Looks like we got a goose. You want a dwarf named Deadeye? Okay. Where did my... There it is. Wait, did I put it... Oh, that's dumb. <laughs> that doesn't do us any good. Hey, I want you dogs to hang out up there in the sky. So let's put this on the ground level. That'll make it a little bit easier for the animals to uh, go where they're supposed to go. And uh, this is going to be a pasture. And we want... Oh, we got a lamb. Oh, check that out. That's cool. I built a kitchen a long time ago, and I never did anything with it. Kitchen. I want you to make me some easy meals, please. Um, okay, that's... Easy meals are fine. We like biscuits. Still is not doing that anymore. Please do. Still no seeds, because we're not making anything from outside. Gather a few more plants. Okay, floor's getting done. Uh, Deadeye as a dwarf. Okay. Well, we gotta find somebody that's a good, uh, a good shot, I suppose. Anyone that's a good archer? No. Swords dwarf? Axe dwarf? Deadeye the axe dwarf? Okay. Works for me. Everyone's going to be a girl. I hope you're all okay with that. I want you to make me, um, let's make a couple buckets, and then a couple chests, another bed, and anything else we need. We're going to need a couple tables and a couple chairs. This is going to become our living quarters right in here. In fact, um... We're going to make a wall, which is going to go here. Does it need to be that big? Probably not. We're going to get a few doors up, so let's do something like that. And remove those so we can get our wall in there. Actually, we can leave one. One can be a door. So we'll have a wall going here and going around, and this will be our door. Our next wall will go a little bit further out. Anything else out there besides the albatrosses? No, just them. Just hanging out up there. I 
We think the chance of someone falling in here is... I mean, if we get attacked and they dodge, they will certainly fall in. Or if they get hit by something, they'll get backed up. No, you can change it. You can change your number of dwarves anytime. Um, you have to restart the game for it to take effect. But yeah, that's fine. We want an upstair. Go there. Um, you know what? We're going to put another wall. What else is going to go on the other side? Like our, our, um, our table and chairs and things. So let's put another wall here. Move those. I don't want a wall to do something like that. Go one more out this way. I don't have a problem with that. Hmm. That's so finicky building things properly here. Are you trying to tell me? Commit mismatch. So plump helmets being grown. Yes, there they are. Uh, do we we still have some? Oh, we have no. Wait. Oh, we will have seeds. We could just we could switch over to something else real quick. I suppose we can get some dimple cups going. Give them a little bit of variety, and that'll give us seeds as soon as they get done. Um, what's going on there? Why don't we have any fish? So there's fishing to be done. Why aren't we fishing? We don't have a fishery. That could be a problem. Do we set it on the boat? Yeah, let's put something on the boat. Let's put it... Um, down here? Alright, we'll stick it over here. That makes more sense. Boy, thanks, Cox Communications. Um, all right. Let's see if everything is working correctly here.